Information Society Innovation Fund ISIF Asia is a grants and awards program aimed at stimulating creative solutions to the ICT development needs in the Asia Pacific region. The groups ISIF Asia supports carry out development projects that use the internet as a tool to enhance social and economic development in their communities. ISIF is a partnership between the Canadian International Development Research Centre, the Swedish International Development Agency, and the Asia Pacific Network Information Centre, with generous support from the Internet Society and .asia organization. To date, ISIF has allocated around 1.3 million Australian dollars to 43 projects from 17 Asia Pacific economies. The recipients were chosen out of 575 applications from 26 economies. The projects that were selected to receive an ISIF grant showcased innovation, cooperation and technical knowledge. These projects have the potential to create social change in their communities in areas such as communications infrastructure, disaster management systems, mobile health networks and other vital social development tools serving isolated communities, making communications cheaper and more accessible. Projects also reflect current issues in technical and social discussion, including projects that focus on IPv6 and deployment of wireless and mobile technologies. The Asia Pacific is experiencing rapid economic growth. Many of these developing economies are represented in the ISIF Asia grant program. ISIF Asia has supported initiatives from Australia, Bangladesh, Bhutan, Cambodia, India, Indonesia, Malaysia, Micronesia, Myanmar, Nepal, Norway, Pakistan, Philippines, Sri Lanka, Thailand, and Vietnam. ISIF Asia is committed to support local organizations to offer access, services, and application to their own communities in their own languages. ISIF Asia provides opportunities for grant and award recipients to share their experiences. All final reports are published under a Creative Commons license, allowing others to benefit from the technical and practical knowledge gained during the implementation period. The 2013 ISIF Award recognized important contributions to ICT innovation across four categories. Innovation on access provision, Innovation on learning and localization. Code for the common good. Rights. In addition to these four winners chosen by the ISIF selection committee, the Community Choice Award was given to the project received the highest number of votes during the ISIF Asia Awards social media campaign. The award package included 3,000 Australian dollars to support the project's continuation and a travel grant for the representative to join us here at the Internet Governance Forum in Bali, Indonesia. Here is a brief introduction to the ISIF Award 2013 winners. The eToro platform is designed to support the indigenous botanical knowledge management of the Penang community of Long Lamai, Sarawak. Toro is the Penang community's traditional system of collecting food and herbs from the deep forest. eToro has been built using the same knowledge sharing system that the community has used for generations, but the information is captured and stored digitally. Uh, the Penang family go with their kids to the forest where the kids are equipped with the Android based tablet system. Uh, so when their parents teach, uh, teach them about the, about the plants and herbs, the kids can collect the GPS coordinate of the plants, they can collect the pictures and videos of the plants as well as the textual information. After coming back from the journey, uh, inside a community meeting, the contents uh, are uh, verified and it will it is uploaded into the content management system. Uh, the content management system is also developed uh, based on the existing community cultural protocols and it is a secure database uh, where the access is only provide to, uh, provided to the community member. PCE Toro, not only as a project, but more as a way of life. Well, what we have done till now is probably only the first step towards discovering the wonder and beauty of what the community has to offer in their balanced ecosystem, holistic way of approaching things, 
their connection to the nature and their ability to bring out their best. The, the innovative uh, concept in eToro is technologies are part of our daily life. Shikok.com is an online education platform built entirely by volunteer teachers. It was developed in the Bengali language for rural and disadvantaged students in South Asia, and in particular in Bangladesh. Shikok.com was founded by Dr. Raghib Hassan, who wanted to provide quality education to students in their native Bengali language and at a very low cost. The word Shikok is a Bengali word which literally means teacher. Our volunteer teachers include researchers, educators, and high skill experts spread all around the world, but brought together by their deep love for the Bengali language and an interest to spread the light of education to rural students. Students in rural Bangladesh and India don't speak English and they don't have access to quality education. So I founded Shikhak.com, a highly localized massive online open content site which uses the power of the internet to bring together teachers and students and also uses innovative offline methods to spread education. And we used the crowdsourcing model for both content development, deployment and marketing, spending as little as possible. In fact, in our first year, we were able to deliver 1.5 million lectures to 40,000 students at a cost of only 15 US dollars. Ruai SMS is a communication channel created to empower grassroots communities, especially indigenous people communities in West Kalimantan, Indonesia. Ruai TV trained around 200 community members as citizen journalists to use their cell phones to share news and communicate with local authorities. Trainer trains citizen journalists the five basic journalistic theory. The journalists who have been trained then send the news in the form of an SMS to Rai SMS call center. The editor then edited the SMS news and sending it to the governors who have become Rai SMS customer. There are 256 governors who will receive the SMS. System ini terdiri dari satu unit PC, modem, serta kartu GSM. Kemudian sebuah perangkat lunak yaitu frontline SMS. Frontline SMS ini di download secara gratis. Keunggulannya adalah dia bisa mengirim sekaligus ke ratusan nomor pengalaman sekaligus. Amar Desh Amar Gram, My Country, My Village project uses information and communication technologies to create market linkages from the lowest income sectors of the rural and marginalized urban areas, empowering them to break the cycle of poverty. Producers from all around Bangladesh and put them to a virtual shop. Even the omens who are restricted at home and most of their uh, time goes to the domestic works. Now sitting at home, they can trade online without the middleman, no syndications, and they on the other hand getting the fair price. Same way, the whole center which are managing by the youths are creating an unemployment rate. Through the e-commerce, we are actually developing the economic development of a country. And the whole model is very sustainable because the whole center is run by themselves. People are actually benefiting from it. We have training programs, we have uh, weekly gatherings, uh, we show documentaries regarding weather forecasting, agri agricultural issues. So far we have seven centers and all these projects are funded by us. So in future we, when we can make 64 centers in all of our part of the country, we can actually serve 800,000 people of the community and their products will be online so we can trade to the world and obviously our country won't be called a developing country rather it will be called as developed country the design and development of precision agriculture information system for bangladesh project has developed a sensor circuitry for agricultural production that assists with irrigation soil nutrition and fertilization we have developed a sensor circuitry that can measure the phosphorus, ammonium, nitrogen, nitrate, nitrogen and soil moisture. And this is the circuit design 
and we have also developed a precision agricultural information system model that uses the sensor-based data collection system, its storage and analysis and present using the websites. And we have done several tests in our laboratory and most of the benefits that we can get from this project is the optimized land, fertilizer and pesticide uses, increasing the productivity, so reducing the soil salinity, lower production cost, maximum utilization of modern suitable technology and reduced operation overhead. We congratulate the ISIF award winners and trust that the support received will help them to continue their journey innovating and addressing the needs in the Asia-Pacific region through creative ICT solutions. As proud members of the CETA Alliance, we are committed to help ideas to grow, so we are continuously seeking for new partners, sponsors, and supporters to be part of the continuation and evolution of ISIF Asia. If you are interested to support ISIF Asia, please contact the ISIF Secretariat at info at ISIF.Asia.